Hello guys again, welcome to my channel. Audi recently announced a new sporty SUV, the SQ8, let's find out what's new. The 2024 Audi SQ8 shares its foundation and powertrain with the extreme Lamborghini Urus despite its unassuming appearance. In acceleration tests the SQ8 almost matches the Lambo even though the Urus's twin-turbo V8 engine has been toned down in the Audi to produce just 500 horsepower. What's new for 2024? In 2024 the SQ8 had a stylistic makeover to better match the appearance of its electric sibling the SQ8 East Tron. It has a more contemporary appearance thanks to a revised grille and front bumper and its sleek new headlights which use lasers for the high beams look great. Additionally, you can customize the appearance of the daytime running lights with the user-selectable signatures on the headlights. Completing the design revisions are new wheel designs updated taillights, a new color scheme reworked interior trimmings and updated seat designs. Pricing of new SQ8 is splitted in two trim options, Premium Plus that costs $97,795 and Prestig with $104,795 cost. Any SQ8 model you choose you'll receive the same driving experience because they're all equipped with the best performance-enhancing equipment Audi has to offer. The SQ8E's well-known 4.0-liter V8 twin-turbo engine produces 568 pounds-feet of torque and 500 horsepower. It also comes standard with an 8-speed automated gearbox and all-wheel drive. The SQ8 reached 60 mils per hour at test track in only 3.6 seconds trailing the mechanically identical but more potent Lamborghini Urus by just 0.4 seconds. Audi's S variants are known for having more standard features and luxurious materials inside than the base model. This includes contrast stitching carbon fiber trim diamond stitched seats and black accents throughout the cabin. The roomy baggage area and rear seat which can accommodate five people are helpful features for long car journeys. Every SQ8 from Audi comes equipped with the brand's virtual cockpit changeable gauge display and a dual touchscreen infotainment system. Customers who are tech savvy will be drawn to the nearly all digital cabin but others who prefer tactile controls for functions like climate control won't be impressed. I hope you all enjoyed the video, feel free to comment about it and hit the like button if you think it was useful. Have a great day and see you next time!